Uh, no? She does not get her sneak attack on the second one. Oh, okay. So you only get one four sneak damage? attack. Yes. Yay! So it's very fun. Okay. Uh, you should have a little bit of movement, uh, but if you run away, then he gets a sneak attack, or he gets a opportunity attack against you. So. Yeah, no, no. Okay. I'll just stay and hope he doesn't aim for me. I get to do something! <laughs> what is this? Ah. If I roll a one, everybody's getting killed. <laughs> hey, welcome back, Robin. Oh. I know, right? And if you, they probably were there. <laughs> hey, we all live! <laughs> we all live! <laughs> you get two attacks. Huh? What? Uh, I'm trying to remember if he gets two attacks. I no, he know. doesn't. It's just one. <laughs> I don't believe you. <laughs> Uno momento. While I okay. find his actual... I have his notes, but not his. Maybe we might gonna attack this. What extra damage done for... Okay. Oh, right crap. Back. Hold on one okay. sec, Nikki. Okay. Uh, all right. Bubbles should work. If the bubble surprise is a... Nope. In a second. Um, I had restarted my computer just now. One right hit. before we started, because my... Or, it's my... Skype wasn't working. All right. It should be up now. This isn't right. I I was just about. Did he have shot. only have one attack? One attack. Okay. The and reason he got two attacks on me the first time was because he had a surprise. Oh, gotcha. Uh, so yeah, when I fought him, he had two attacks, but that was just because it was a surprise. This this isn't right. I thought I'd have to fudge the dice or something to keep you guys alive. <laughs> now I'm gonna start fudging the dice so you guys take some damage. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh crap! Muted myself. Hold on. Thank you very much for the host, Robin. I appreciate it. So, Krug. Welcome back. Stands up. He's growl, growly, and then he takes four hits out of nowhere. He goes, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> <laughs> I bet he's wondering if this is a nightmare or something. <laughs> he's like, am I awake? I did not do that right. Okay. You didn't lose any hours, Smithy. I, I said I just at, restarted it just uh, now, right before we started this. So if anything, you lost completely. maybe about thirty minutes. Hey, we have exactly. something in common. You're as you're as <laughs> incomparable as I am. He what must, did he do? Uh, he took a swing at him, missed completely. He rolled a two. Oh, lovely. Yeah, two. I'm going to use this die ever again. Uh, and missed completely, and uh, that's his turn. Okay. Niffy! Uh, I'm just going to magic missile him again with my second, you know, thing. Oh, wait, you know what? Oops. Hold on. I'm holding. Uh. You should have a damage. Uh, how is... Yeah, I do, but I wanted something... I, I'm thinking of something else. How is his... Stability. How does he look? Very the bugbear. Weak right Very now. weak. Yes, he does not look like he's steady. He is bleeding out of four different cuts. Uh, yeah, not for me. All right, here's my my idea. The reason why I'm hesitating. I could either make the dog sleep so that he doesn't actually join in, or I could attack and possibly kill the bugbear. That's what Niffy is well, let's see. thinking the dog about is real quick. Next. No, the dog, the dog is on our side technically, sort of, right now. Unless yeah. he sends him after one. Unless Bugbear wins a thing to make the dog not neutral. That's why I like calling it right now. I probably I know that's sorry, not the right word. Right now, I feel like okay. the dog's neutral, where he's My not attacking another. My suggestion is, if you want to keep the dog, you better put him to sleep. Or I could just kill the bugbear, and then the bugbear would be dead, and then the dog would just sure. be there. So I'm just deciding if I could possibly one-shot the bugbear or not. That's what I'm thinking about right now. Is there a saving throw, or is it just automatic sleep? I didn't actually look uh, at the sleep, so... Sleep, uh, in order to use sleep, you roll uh, 5d8. <clears throat> Whatever the number comes up, you... 
uh, pick an area, and every creature starting with the lowest HP goes to sleep uh, from... Uh, okay, you have a mob that has 5 HP, he's the lowest, you take 5 away from whatever you roll. Then the next one, you take, you know, the next one's 7, you take 7 away. You go, you do that until there's no, uh, nothing left. So if there's one, it'd be fine. Yes. Uh, it's a 30 foot sphere, though, if I remember right. So I would um, have to cast it like, like, uh, 20 feet, 30. 20 feet uh, away from us. Yeah, it's a 20 foot sphere, so you would have to cast it like around here. Okay. But mm. yeah, it is, you don't want to put us to sleep. That is yeah. your second slot of death. Mm-hmm. All right, I think I'm going to risk it and just do a cantrip instead to attack the guy. Okay. Okay. Um, Because I think we're, we've almost got this guy de- dead. So, yeah. Um... I think it was Firebolt that didn't have the, yes. the dex thingy. So yeah. Uh, uh, I'm yeah, Firebolt is... Firebolt. Yeah. Uh, That's a 1d10, I think. No. Uh, no? You make a ranged spell attack. That is uh, 1d12 plus your intelligence modifier. Which should be like 3 uh, four. I'm looking right now. Intelligence modifier is 3. Uh, no, and you have proficiency, so it's 5. Oh, how do I, you know if I have proficiency? Um, well, you, you have proficiency because it's a spell. Oh, okay. Oh. I put plus three, so do I just add two to that number? or? Yeah, it, it would be 11 okay. to hit, and it does not hit. It doesn't? No. Uh, it misses him. Crap, I made a bad mistake decision. I should have just gone with magic missile. All right, good luck, guys. Thank you. Actually, it's my turn. So never mind. Uh, good luck, me. More about that dog. <laughs> I don't think he's well, gonna do anything. He's snoozing. Yeah. He's still snoozing. Cool. Choctaw. The reason well, I didn't think I he was gonna do to anything. Him. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. Maybe I can prove to him I'm a better person since <laughs> I missed than he missed. Now, uh, I can't use my fire, so. My acid, I mean. I can't use that. So I may get get it on my, my you teammates. You would just have to direct it, direct it to make sure it doesn't hit them. Uh, i got to find out something here. You are capable of doing that, but don't necessarily know if that would be a good idea. No. Yeah. i probably just whack them. I am em. going to drop my shield mm. and try a two-handed sword. Okay. Now, that does not increase your accuracy at all. Yeah, but I yeah. Okay. Does it increase his damage? It increases his damage by uh, a, it's a it's a D eight with a one handed and a D ten with a two handed, if I remember correctly. So only two different two damage difference. What does yes. the shield give in defense? Two. Com- two. So yeah. it's, he's just losing two defense to two attack. Okay. Yeah. Uh, possible. Two. Yeah. Yeah. Ready? Yep. Yeah. Roll it. Hey! Sleep on Niffy. Did I finally hit something? Uh, you you criticaled him. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, you hit him pretty hardcore. Yeah, you got twenty five, like you attack on him. Take a swing two handed, chop his head off, and while the head is still in the air, come back for another swing and chop it in half. <laughs> nice. Wow. It's about action time style. I yeah, that is sixteen points of damage when he had one HP. Left. Good job. Yay. And none of us took any damage. Woo! <laughs> you guys stink. <laughs> well, thank you. Now we have a puppy for. Yay! Oh, are we gonna are we gonna take him back and sell mm-hmm. him, or are you no. gonna carry him around? What? Oh yeah, we gotta take the head with us, don't we? Ah uh, no, that's the orcs. Oh, the orcs. That's right. Sorry, my bad. Well, we got all. What is all this treasure here? We need to accumulate all that. Um, that was the supply stuff from the. Uh, oh, lion, lion shield. Lion, lion shield. Yes. Are you sure? He, I thought I you said know. it. Or We're let's look. Tre- let's look it all up and see if there's a supply crates. Because she said we would know. Because something. Yeah. Uh, if you look around the chamber on the. The blue side lion of the crates, on the shield. There we yeah, go. Is their symbol. 
Uh, it is obviously their supplies. However, there is more than you guys could handle. It would require a wagon in order to move everything. Okay. Mm. Um... So we have to make, take back proof and then bring a trailer back? A wagon, or we could just let them know and then they could come and bring wagon yeah. here. But we still have to finish adventuring the whole area because they can't get a wagon up that cliff and there's that exit right there I can notice. So we probably should do a perception check towards that exit. Probably a good idea. And can I take the dog with me now? Yes. Okay. <laughs> does the dog yes. have a name? Uh, no, he does not. Aw, I need to give him a so name what are you soon. Call him? I don't know Bug yet. Bear. You know call what? Yes, I'm gonna call him Bugbear. No, oh. you know what? That might actually cause like issues because I'm like Bugbear, and then people are like, "Where? Where? Oh my god!" <laughs> and then running away. <laughs> okay, you could call him BB. Yeah, I think I'll call him BB. So much like VV. Uh, yes! BB the VV. Yeah, 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 sounds awesome. Um, so they took his dog, named it BB for Bugbear. Okay. Okay. Uh, I will give you the stats for the wolf. Well, if you want the stats, I'll give you the stats for him later on. Yeah, yeah. I'm not but, actually going to have him as a pet yet. I'm just taking him so I can train him as a pet. So you put a chain around him he already has a very crude collar on and uh bring him along correct or are you yes. leaving him in the chamber for right now um oof 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 um i want to do before i even grab him i want to kind of like uh come over oh why not let me grab my character uh you are on the ruler oh uh, my bad there we go I want yeah, to come uh, over like right here. On this map, because it's way everything's out of whack. I did this map terribly. Looks fine. Well, it's a good. The map is fine. It's just I shouldn't have done it this way. I I uh, wanted to make it big so you could see everything, and in the meantime, I just messed up the this perspective. I didn't see crap. If he comes over here too. There's a nice fire in front of you. And perception check. Mother. A, a fire? Oh, All right. yeah. There's a nice fire in front of you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, I say I can't see anything because I got something in my eye. So <laughs> <laughs> you come over here and look. There was some dust over here and got in both me and Niffy's eyes. So I asked one of you guys to take a look because I can't see anything. I can look. <laughs> <laughs> No, Robin, I won't do it. Oops. There you go. There Got we over. go. All right. I am assuming that you're peeking outside of the chamber, correct? Yeah. Okay. To the north. Uh, you see, and I'm going to have to do this in a few parts. Oh, wow. Yep. You see everything. Uh, <clears throat> there is... Uh, I need to find it on the sheet because I haven't been reading off what you see. But uh, this cavern is half filled with two large pools of water. A narrow water waterfall high in the eastern wall feeds the pool, which drains out the western end of the chamber to form the stream that flows out the cave mouth below. Low fieldstone wall serves as a dam holding the water in. A wide exit stands to the south while two smaller passages lead west. The sound of the waterfall echoes through the cavern, making it difficult to hear. Three goblins guard the cave, one of them standing upon <clears throat> the uh, one of the dams, and it looks as though, uh, ignore his character icon, it looks as though he is carrying an axe or a shovel, something to break the dam. <gasps> oh... He's trying to break the dam because the river probably goes into town, right? You guys didn't go the direction you're supposed to go. <laughs> <laughs> if you go the other way and make a bunch of noise, they break the dam and all the water flushes you out. Oh, gotcha. Hence a dead bard. <laughs> Fair enough. I get why you got drowned. <laughs> we went the wrong way. Nice. 
Uh, that's too good.